welcome to CC's Texas Garden. I am Cynthia. Welcome to my channel. If you've been here before, welcome back. So guys, I have a seed haul today from my bestie. God, she spoils me with the seeds. When I go over there, it's just like Toys R Us for kids. Not sponsored by the way, but <laughs> I have so much fun at Nicole Smith Gardening. I will link her description down below. Um, but guys, look at this. It's like candy. <laughs> so I'm gonna go over it and I am going to try to post what the, the seed, flower, plant, whatever looks like. So this will be my first time trying to do, I'm gonna try to do, I'm gonna try to do it in the same picture with me if not, it will be right after I say it, then I'll post a picture. So, I haven't tried that with my editing software. We'll see if it works. Okay? So, y'all ready? Okay. Now, let me know in the description if you have these seeds or if you have grown them before. And if you can give me any help on different ones of these. Um, and tell me what you liked about it or didn't like about it. Okay? Yeah, a lot of homework. But just say something in the comments, y'all. I like reading the comments. Okay, we're going to start out with the Coleus Rainbow Blend. Coleus Rainbow Blend. Um, I've never grown Coleus. And so, that's the Rainbow Blend one. And some of these words, I am not going to say correctly. I am sorry, but I'm not going to. So this next one here is soap wart, soap wart. And I will post to show you what that is. Some of these are herbs because I was, I was telling her I needed some herbs for the planter uh, herb challenge grow off uh, that will be in March. And so I needed some herbs y'all. So she hooked me up. Next is ashwagandha next green stripe kusha now i know y'all was all with the kusha this year but i'm in there too this year y'all <laughs> got me some seeds my bestie hooked me up she's like we're gonna grow these big old things so So cabbage cordé bleu, cordé bleu, cabbage. Big rainbow tomato, big rainbow tomato. Yeah, she hooked me up with tomato seeds. I guess your girl is going to be doing tomatoes and fighting them stupid hornworms this year. Marshmallow, y'all. Yeah. Did you know marshmallow actually come from a plant? Like you can actually make the marshmallows from there's the seeds to make marshmallows. What? I you know, I was just thinking it was like just man-made. I did not realize that it's actually marshmallow flowers. This is Mexican marigold. I have French marigolds and I have African marigolds. And now I have Mexican marigolds. This is early purple sprouting broccoli. I probably need to put some of these in the ground and try to see if I can get some. I tried before, none of mine came up. So I'm going to try again. All right. This is what my bestie calls the dirty toenails. Look at them. Look at them things, y'all. Y'all know what that is? Calendula. Calendula. Mm -hmm. Sunset buff. Sunset, no. Sunset bluff. Calendula. Now I have red vein sorrel. Red vein sorrel. Let me know if you have that. My bestie likes to go on on different um, <laughs> websites and get all kind of crazy stuff. 
So I'm excited. I just, yeah. <laughs> All right. This is the toothache plant. The toothache plant, y'all. It's such a beautiful looking um, flower plant. But uh, we got seeds up in there. Next, Tabasco peppers. I'm going to grow me some peppers this year. I am determined. Your girl is going to have a big per pepper, pepper harvest this year. We're not playing. We are not playing. We're not going to be sitting up there having to go buy some pepper starts because mom won't act right. Okay, we're not having that. Um, cello. <laughs> I'm going to mess that word up. Cello, cellosa. Pampas. Pam, pampas. Pull, I don't know what that. C E L. O S I A. Seeds. <laughs> Got some more ground cherries. Pineapple. Pineapple ground cherries. I grew these. I told my bestie, if if yours don't act right again like this year, I will hook you up with some more of my uh ground cherries. The first time I planted them, they didn't come out. They was a little small. But then the second time I planted them. They were nice and we we got to we enjoy them okay I have some yarrow yarrow seeds then I have oriental yard long beans now I had the red um, oriental long beans these are the green ones I have two seeds of that, so we're going to make it work. We're going to make it work. Lamb's ear. You know that's so cute. Lamb's ear. Amaranth. Got some amaranth. Uh-huh. Quarantine. It's a leak. I don't know what kind of leak this is. Car antin. Carantin. It's a leak. Guys, I got some cumin. If you're making any Mexican dishes, cumin must be a part of the essentials. It's just like when you do garlic powder, onion powder. Definitely got to have cumin. That's what just bring out the Mexican flavors. Yeah, I know. have some moringa yeah. moringa seeds so I heard that I was supposed to plant them in the spring let me know if that's correct but I heard that I was supposed to start them in the spring uh, I kind of want to see if I can start them indoors so then when the spring get here I can be like bam put them out there I don't know let me know Broccoli, Romanesco, we're going to try that again. I'm going to go out there and plant these and see if I can get some broccoli, Romanesco. There is some chamomile, Roman. Roman chamomile. I have um, German chamomile, I think. But now this is Roman chamomile. My chamomile have, didn't do good for me. I mean, it rose and then it just, I don't know, it got stunted or something. We have some oregano. This oregano, y'all, I mean, oregano is like dust. I mean, how do you even collect something? It's, it's just like dust. If you breathe on it, you'll lose it. <laughs> we have some wild bee balm. Wild Bergnant bee balm. We got bee balm. And last but not least, guys, these tomatoes is called black semen. <laughs> Ain't no pause in this. That's what the name of this tomato is. We're gonna go with it. <laughs> 
that is my haul from my bestie i appreciate you so much nicole we have man we're like sisters and we met over the internet we did not know each other a year ago i did not know who nicole was from anybody else and man the power of the internet the power of having a channel that you get to meet so many different people so thank you for watching this haul guys if you have not hit that subscribe button please do i would love for you to be a part of my garden family let you know what's going on in my garden here in texas and i will see y'all next time